This is a warning to Jamel, the hitman Charlo. Why is it even when Jamel is happy, he's still angry? Like, am I the only one that thinks he's mad and happy at the same time? Like, anyway, this is a warning to the undisputed champion at 154, also known as Super Welterweight, Jamel the Hitman Charlo. Listen, bro, Canelo doesn't have to fight you. You have every right as the undisputed champion of 154 to call out Canelo. But why not fight Terence Crawford? Why not fight the guy that's closer to your weight class? Why is it when a fighter is calling out Canelo Alvarez, they're like 45 weight classes apart? Like, you know what I mean? There's so much for you to do at 160, but you just want to skip that like it's not a weight class. Listen to me, Jamal. Canelo will not fight you because he has so many options. And this goes for Errol Spence, Jamal, Jamel, Edgar, Demetrius Andrade. You see all of those guys I've mentioned. You guys are lined up as if you're the next opponent for Canelo Alvarez. You need to make your own legacy. Jamel, why don't you try to call out Bivol? Why don't any of you guys call out Bivol? That's the guy you should really be chasing. I mean, he's the only one who got the best of Canelo. Why don't you fight him? Why are people still calling out Canelo? Bivol wants that smoke. People should be gearing to fight Bivol. But no, even when Canelo lost, you might not still trying to fight him. Canelo can have 50 losses and you guys will still be trying to fight him. Canelo isn't the only fighter or shall I say, great fighter in boxing. Terence Crawford, Jamel, is one weight class below you. But still, for some reason, you don't want to fight him. Jamel, I know deep down, you don't want to fight Crawford. I know if you have to, you will, but you don't want to fight Crawford. You want to fight Canelo, because he looked weak in his last performance. Because I've never seen you call out Canelo to fight until his performance against John Ryder. But you don't want to fight Crawford because you don't want to lose again. And you don't want to have the risk of starting over again. You lose to Canelo, you can still come back because it's Canelo. Jamel, you're not taking that Canelo route. I'm not going to let you take that Canelo route, bro. Canelo has so many options lined up. Why would he fight you? Why? I know Crawford will fight you. But you don't want that work. You don't want that work. It's becoming a trend at this point to call out Canelo. Jamel, Canelo will not fight you. You see Jamal? Jamal's whole career was banked. It was surrounded. It was basically made on the, on the cusp that he would fight Canelo Alvarez. But he didn't. And that sent him two years of inactivity. He was waiting for the fight. And look what happened to Jamal. He's nowhere to be seen right now. And Jamal, if you're not careful, that's going to be you. Crawford has mentioned your name several times to fight. But yet, you haven't acknowledged it. Terence Crawford wants to fight, Jamal. The question is, do you?